Uh, hi guys, welcome to part 2 of my Fofix tutorial. Um, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to get your instruments working with the game. Um, I only have the 360 instruments available so that's what I'm going to be using for this tutorial. Um, I believe you can get PS3 instruments working with it, but you may need um, third party drivers to, to do that. Um, if I find them I'll put them in the description and I'll also put the links to the official 360 drivers for Windows in the description as well. Um, but what you want to do is you want to first of all plug your instrument in before you start the game, otherwise the game won't recognise it. Um, when you do it, your uh, little speech bubble should come up here saying uh, 360 controller device recognised or something like that. Um, once that's done you can start the game up and now what you have to do is you, using your keypad, using your keyboard, press go to options, go to control settings, then new controller. Uh, you can call it whatever you want. Um, for this video, I'm just going to call it uh, guitar one. I think I've already got control called guitar. But uh, yeah, call it whatever you want. And uh, with me right now, I've got my Guitar Hero 2 Explorer hooked up. So I'm going to uh, be using this standard guitar type. But if you want to do drums, you use drum set for drum. But anyway, I'll show you how to do guitar first. What you have to do is select the um, key you want to associate. Then on the guitar, you press the respective button. So if you want to set um, strum, which is called pick in this game, you press enter on your keyboard. Then on your guitar, just use your guitar and strum, oh, strum it, strum downwards, and that's it. With secondary pick, you just get your guitar up strum, and fret one is green, and you just press the green. No strumming, just press green for that for the frets. And it's pretty much the same for everything here as well. With fret 2, you just uh, press red, yellow, blue, and orange there. Um, it's, you don't need to worry about solo frets. With the left, you just press, obviously, the D-pad and all these buttons here. With cancel, just associate that with back. With start, you press start. With star power, you can tilt the guitar. It will pick it up. And with the whammy, just push the whammy bar in. Um, that's all you need to do to set it. Um, to set your buttons. Uh, you shouldn't have any issue with that. If you do, you can um, comment and I will help you out. But as, but again, all you have to do, press enter on the key you want to associate, then press the, the button on the guitar and it should um, pick it up. And it's the same with drums. Just hook your drums up. You get an option to do two drums per, well, two keys per drum. Um, you should only need one if you're using a rock band drum set. Just uh, of course these are red, yellow, blue, and green. You get the option to do double bass, but they have to be two separate keys. It can't be like um, if you're using a double bass adapter, the official double bass adapter. You can't have one pedal of that and one pedal there because it will pick it up as the same uh, thing, I believe, as the same key. But I'm not entirely sure. But um, yeah, with the with this you just press the D-pad, and start and cancel is just start and back. You don't need to worry about star power because there's drum fills in the game. So again, just to reiterate, press enter on the key you want to set, and then press the relative button on the controller. So um, again, fret 2, you press red. Press enter, this is what exactly what I'm pressing, enter on the keyboard, yellow on the guitar, and that sets it. Then, once you're done there, you press escape, get back out of that, then you set the controller to guitar one or whatever you may have called it otherwise uh, it won't recognize it once that's done you should be able to use your um, guitar or whichever instrument you've done um, that's all there is to it, you can just back out and you can start using it from here um, that's yeah that's all there all is to it I know this has been a short video but hopefully it's been helpful to all of you trying to get your instruments working with it if you do have any issues as I say um, please post a comment and I'll be happy to help you out. Uh, thanks for watching this video.